if a customer shows up in your office and needs help uh, with an invoice or a transaction on uh, one of their invoices, and they happen to have that invoice with them, um, the invoice will have an invoice ID number. And it's really easy to, to find uh, the invoice for management um, using that ID number. Simply log into the back office area, look under the main admin menu. Uh, there is an option called invoice lookup. Simply press the link, type in the invoice ID number, and then press the lookup button. Uh, the options that are then displayed include the invoice number and the buyer's name and their ID. There is an, uh, a form field uh, called uh, pull location. Now, not everyone uses a pull location. This is uh, if after the um, auction has ended, if you group together the items that a buyer has, has um, uh, purchased into a common area and you have a location ID for that area, then you could enter that here. Uh, maybe we'll say something like, uh, so there's no, it's not even necessary to put something in there. Um, if the uh, invoice is being marked as picked up, like the buyer is, has received absolutely all of the items on the invoice, uh, then you can simply check, uh, check that uh, box right next to the mark invoice picked up area. Um, the options below, however, will also allow you to, uh, so if you press the finish button at this point, then that's all that's going to happen. There will be a pull location assigned to the invoice, and it will be marked as having been picked up. Um, so in this case, I don't want to do either of those. I simply want to open um, the invoice for editing. So to do that, I press the, um, the button that says open invoice for editing. And now I'm looking at the administrative view of the invoice. I can tell uh, there's you know, a balance due on here, and uh, it's not marked as paid. So perhaps the, the buyer wants to make a payment here. Uh, in which case, um, you can do that and simply press the button that says add payment. Uh, maybe they're making a cash payment. That's maybe why they're even in the office in the first place. So we simply add their payment. Now the invoice is paid. Uh, if I close this dialog box, I still have this other one open behind it. Um, and so now if I wanted to, I could, um, we can print the invoice. And now you can see uh, the print dialog box opens up. Uh, there we go, sorry about that. Um, so the print dialog box opens up, there's the invoice right there, it's paid in full, and, that's, and I can uh, close out of there as well. When I'm, all, when I'm all done, if it's been, let's say that they have uh, now paid and they've picked up, I would just mark the invoice as having been picked up. Uh, again, there's no need to enter a pull location unless that's what you're doing. I press the finish button and that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.